So you know I had to choose on she You like her, but she like me I think I really like she And niggas be like, who is she? Hey babies, it's Joy Nivon and welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new then welcome so today i am back with another video and this is both a hair and kind of makeup transformation video in one so this beautiful unit that you're looking at right here is from eva wigs i will leave all the specific details to this hair down below in the description box but this is 22 inches it's kinky straight um the hair color is number one and number three and the lace color that i got is medium brown so everything else that you might want to know i will leave the density information all that down below so as you can see the hair does come with these clips attached there's three clips there's two on each side and then there's one in the front as well like right above where the lace is so what i'm doing for this wig personally even though i love how natural it is kinky straight i will be wand curling this hair now this process is pretty repetitive so i will be kind of speeding through this but i just want to show you you know how i kind of curl it so i start from the bottom while the hair is on the wig head and i kind of just move up to the top and I didn't cut this hair in any particular way like I didn't put layers in it or anything I might do that in the future so I don't know but I absolutely love this hair you guys this hair is so thick it mimics natural hair texture perfectly which if you know me then you know I have natural hair if you're subscribed to my channel so you know that that's like what I'm all about and as far as this color I thought the color would be great for summertime springtime you know so even though this is a lot of hair to like be wearing in the heat i still feel like you can pull it off if you can tolerate that type of thing and for me i can pretty much tolerate it and you can wear this hair up so that works too like but i just find that wigs are great protective style options for traveling and vacations and all of that and the color of this hair like i was saying before i feel like it's just great for the season i was kind of inspired by scissors hair color that she kind of like goes back and forth with like this kind of ginger reddish color and it really shows up like more so ginger than just like a reddish brown on camera um it shows off really ginger in person like outside in the sun and everything so i really really love this hair i was rocking this hair for about three or four days i want to say before i actually recorded this and curled it i was just kind of rocking it and i really enjoyed it it did not shed on me too bad at all just like your typical average amount of shedding like when combing it but if i didn't comb through my hair like a lot um it didn't shed but this is how the curls are turning out and as you can see they came out really nicely so i'm just going to move along to my makeup so for my makeup as you guys saw in the intro i wanted to go for something purple um not too dramatic by my standards but just something wearable and pretty so that's what i did i'm not going to talk through this process because i just kind of want this to be a speed through i don't want to like have this video be super duper long for you guys but i do know a lot of you guys enjoy my makeup and always ask me questions about it so i wanted to include this in the transformation process to getting glam so if you're interested in you know what products and everything i use for this i will leave all that information down below in the description box where the information for eva wigs will be so be sure to check that out but i will be back in a minute once we get back to the wig Check it out. 
So now that my makeup is done, I'm moving on to this wig again, and as you can see, my cap is medium brown, like I said, so it's a blending in very nicely with my complexion and everything. And so what I'm going to do is just use these clips to clip the wig down to my head. I'm not, um, you know, making this too tight or anything. It is a comfortable fit for me, so there's that make sure that you kind of measure your head if you're going to order a wig because you will kind of have to know your cap size so right here I just decided to try and make some like faux baby hairs now you guys I am NOT a wig expert a wigologist <laughs> none of that I do kind of know how to do my hair I feel like I fend off very well so I was confident enough to do this myself if you're not then you know ask someone who you trust in that you feel like you know would be good at this type of thing but it's absolutely not hard I did have a pre-plucked hairline though so I didn't have to like do the most after I cut off the lace but just because I wanted to kind of make this look as natural as possible and I didn't want to have any of my edges out whatsoever I just decided to create some little extra baby hairs so once I was satisfied with that all I'm doing is just taking your typical got to be glue gel and I'm using the one in the yellow bottle and I'm just kind of trying <laughs> to create like baby hairs so I'm trying to you know get my edges together and kind of just create that whole look that whole thing like I said you guys I am not an expert at this so trust me and believe me when I say if I could do this you can do this like literally this process is time consuming but I feel like it's worth it at the end especially if you don't want to take your wig off you know like if you glue your entire or gel your entire wig down to your head and you don't want to take it off I feel like when you have baby hairs and everything it kind of just helps the wig look more natural for a long time so at this point I was pretty satisfied with how my baby hairs came out I was very proud of myself at this moment so I just decided to lay my edges down to dry with the elastic band that came in the packaging actually and you know I took it off after a little while I want to say like maybe 15 minutes and then I took my hair down and I'm using a wide tooth comb to brush through it or comb through it sorry and this is how the curls came out it gave me a nice wavy effect and it was just it was so pretty I just love this wig so much it's so soft this hair is just everything this color is just everything they slayed this I feel like I did a good job installing it I did the whole you know contour powder trick you know with the part and everything and I really like how it came out I 
love 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 this wig so like i said be sure to check the description box down below on how you can get your hands on this wig but until then that's pretty much all you guys need to know from me so be sure to follow me on all social media at join avon as well as eva wigs and also leave me some comments and you know all that fun stuff talk to me nice down below in the comment section i love and appreciate you guys thank you so much for watching this video if you made it this far please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my channel for more and until then i will see you guys in my next video bye